Welcome back to AVP Bad Blood. We are knocking out our little scarification ritual here to finish up for the second time, Blood Drinker. Uh, well, our slave's mental break, like usual. It is an evening, uh, so we'll probably let him go after this. We do have a pot out here to deal with, so we'll probably do that pretty soon in the morning, I guess. It might be good to leave it, actually, until the prison gets cleared out more. I could also do this, and then Shorty can be moved to the other prison bed, presumably. Oh, also, these guys are wearing some different clothing than we might want them to wear. Well, that didn't really make much of a difference, did it? Only, only some of their stuff actually was removed. Um, just want to get the excess armor out of there, I guess. To be fair, the blindfold probably helped us. Plus one on that. Well, he should be back to normal now. Scarified, yes. Okay, great. Cool. Yeah, I think we'll save this. I think we'll just wait. Oh, fuck, a Neomorph. Oh, no, that's really bad. Wait, why are there Neomorphs here? Oh, shit. Shit. Fungus spores down here. But then the animals must have tripped across it. Oh, do we have fungus spores anywhere else? Okay, we got a situation. Okay, okay. Um, predators out here. I need a I need a volunteer. Quotation marks. Alistair, you're probably gonna do it. Uh, how about one of these nice flamethrowers we have in the stockpile? How about we grab one of those? Now, Alistair, I need you to come over here and uh, burn the jungle down. Okay, that's one dead Neomorph. We've got a Chinchilla there we can bring in too. Actually, yeah, let's let these melee guys just go because they're not worth the effort of, like, microing their position. Slug. Still slow with a bum leg, I guess. Where's the other Neomorph? Why were you a different color? Let's not question it. Maybe you weren't a different color. Um, so this one's still feeding over here. Okay, one dead, two dead Neomorphs. Good. Uh, that, I guess it ate an entire Okapi. Now here's the problem. How many other animals have wandered over by those Neomorph spores? And become infected. We'll have to keep an eye out for quite a while for other Neomorphs. Alright, don't you dare mental break while you're down here or you're fucked. I'm um, also curious, there's like... This whole place looks a little purple to me, which isn't great. Swing over this way, maybe. Bacon's back. Like, oh man, I can't tell with in the jungle. Strange fungus there, obviously. It's so hard to tell with the jungle where strange fungus might be hiding under these trees. This stuff is fucking deadly, because if you walk into it, you're just done. It's over for you. Which makes sense. That's how it is in Covenant. That's a very interesting flamethrower. I'm not sure it's actually hitting the fungus at all. It's really not. There it is. Fungus is on fire. We're just gonna we're just gonna keep him doing this uh, until it's gone. Because if the fire goes out, it's gotta get relit. And it is raining, because of course it's fucking raining. 
We'll just pick a mid distance so it's not so deafeningly loud. Mad Boomalopes. How many? Multiple Mad Boomalopes. They. That's dumb. <laughs> That's annoying. At least it's raining. I guess we'll draft everybody except for. Who is down here? Alistair. Except for Alistair. And we'll just put him in the kill box in a big clump and they'll die. The boomalops will die. But the big thing is to just not have anybody get caught by them outside. Because that would be <clears throat> rather annoying. Uh, can we see if you guys are infected over here? No health conditions, no health conditions. I don't trust this chicken. It might be a neomorph in disguise. Strange fungus nearly dead. Fire is what you do. Usually you can just light it and forget it, but with the rain here, I was not feeling so good. I want to remove this purple. This purple makes me real suspicious. So we're just going to truck you up here, presuming that the boomalopes are not heading towards you, of course. No, they're already running into the traps over there, so we're good. All right, I need you to just, just go over there and just... Just, if it's purple, shoot it. Right? I don't, I'm not sure if this is going to spawn more. So basically what happens is you get these ships that drop, and then the ships start spreading the purple around, and then that turns into, like, the spores. So, oh my god, they destroyed so many traps. I should just home zone these for automatic rearmament. I just haven't bothered. I guess, in theory, like... I might want to manage them individually. And in theory, there might come a time when we're not, you know, going to bother the rearm. Okay, that looks pretty okay. Let's get up there again. Maybe a little bit over here. Maybe a little bit over there. Shoot that chicken, I don't trust it. And it still looks a little purple over here. Get some more fire out there, my dear. Right. You're probably fine to switch back to your weapon. You had, I don't know, take some feral submachine guns. That's probably what you had. Okay, we're gonna presume that this problem is solved. It may not be. So we gotta keep an eye on it. But I think we nipped the Neomorph infestation in the bud before it became an issue. This is why I was keeping fire around. Can you imagine if we had like a herd of pigs wander into that fungus patch? And then spawn just a dozen Neomorphs? I mean, we're lucky we saw the Neos when we did, too. I think it's been dealt with. I think most of this is just char. Whoa, wait, wait, wait. I, no, that was Strangler Fig Tree, I think. I saw I saw S-T-R-A-N-G, and I thought, oh shit, Strange Fungus, but that appears to be a fern tree. We'll also have to keep an eye on the man we sent out there, just in case we did stumble across any more fungus that we didn't catch. Because if we did, he might turn into a Neomorph. Um... And I don't think you'll know right away. I think it'll take a little bit of time before it pops it up on his uh, health chart. It might pop up on his health chart like right before he freaking dies. Backbursts or whatever. So we really might not have much of a warning. It's about taming on Primal. Okay. Do you want to throw down maybe some more? Tense. That's that's them fighting over there. It always takes me a second. Because we probably got even more unused leather than what we've used here. Might as well just keep building tents. They're good decoys when we get attacked and we like have to fall back inside the base. 
allows us to kind of divide our enemies a bit. Somebody's probably hunting there. They go out and hunt on their own because of that hunter trait. Yeah, I don't see any other evidence of Neomorph infestation here so far. I think it came down with the ship and we caught it before too long. I'm sorry, where's the artifact? I don't see it. Jump to location. Ah, in the field, of course. Storage. Oh my god. What the? These artifacts. Dude, we've had... I've never had artifacts this good. And they're in a series where I, like, can't capitalize on them that much. Like... What am I going to do with 46 advanced components? I legitimately might want to just throw those in the swamp. How much does that affect my well? Hmm. Observed skull spike. Restless time zero. Okay, they're going to want to go on a raid soon. We're going to wait for Restless to tick up. If Restless ticks up and we haven't gotten the quest yet um, for the uh, ship quest to like, travel to the ship and leave, we're just going to go ahead and change bases and kind of just call it a day. thought about making this skull Duchess skull, but... Can't do that to poor Dutch. The bandit camp has moved on. Yeah, I'm not gonna do quests for goodwill, so that's that's fine. Ah, uh, do we get the arm on? We must have because I forget who it was that needed it. I, I guess we can just go through with all of these guys and make sure they're intact. God, we got two dudes that just have double prosthetic arms. That's kind of awful. You got your leg on. You're still missing a lung, both of your eyes and a nose. Which I, I'm ab absolutely staggered that Toll is still in the party. Still hanging around. Okay, yes. Yeah, so definitely whoever needed it, we got it attached. Let's double check our own preds too, just in case. It's easy for a leg to just kind of pop off and miss it. I like that he's got a cochlear implant. That's funny. Just imagine a predator doing all the stuff from uh, a quiet place. That'd be. That, that's what I'm envisioning. <laughs> predator hunting, whatever the hell you call those things from that movie series. I don't even know if they have a name. Using his fucking hearing aid. <laughs> Easily amused. Man, you can hear them from all the way across the base. Wait, Castle Warrior Revenge. Oh, Savant was hunting, probably, for fun. Okay, that's fine. I honestly, that's a really cool trait where they go out and hunt on their own for recreation. Uh, just because it allows them to like passively bring in some extra meat, which is neat. Uh, how about Tropical Wood? We'll just do some random tree stuff just to have it. We're kind of spinning our wheels here on research. But it's not like we have a huge amount of other labor in the colony to do anyway. We really are just waiting on that quest to pop for the ship. Um, so we know which direction to start traveling across the planet. And uh, if it doesn't want to pop up, I don't know what to do about it. Tropical trees are done. Um, do you want carpets? It doesn't make much sense, but there could be some interesting aesthetic things we could do with carpets. I don't know if we have any need for any kind of blades. Could do some drug production. Not really interested. Smoke pop, maybe. Gunsmithing, maybe. I guess, I guess, yeah, let's do gunsmithing. Let's move towards mortars. Um, I'm kind of hoping we won't have to build mortars. We've got the one we salvaged, and I kind of like the idea of salvaging mortars more than I do building them in this colony. I think that's funner, more in line with the Outcast Predator vibe, the Bad Bloods. But we should at least get the research done. I also think it might be the prerequisite for shells, because we, we've only been making uh, EMP shells, which are different. 
Different research prerequisite, I think. Not there. Do we have chem fuel anywhere in this colony? Slave escape toll. Oh, toll, my dear. That's really adorable of you to try. Don't kill him. He's been through a lot. Nice. Um, yeah, he's just stabbed a bunch. No additional damage. Great. Excuse me, why did you have a plain leather round shield? I was going to say, why did you have a heal root? But uh, also that. Is that allowed? Wait, was he carrying that or did he put it on? Okay, he must have been carrying that from somewhere when he was drafted at some point. Um, probably can find a few other people carrying some weird things. Perhaps. Perhaps not. That is always going to make me think that somebody's going on a mental break. I wish they had a. I really wish they had a different sound effect. I might. I might. I don't know, man. I kind of need these for rec, and they're kind of decent, like thematically a decent recreation option for predators. For like training their hunting skills, it's kind of kind of works out good. I'm I am amazed. Toll is is doing it again, trying to escape. Um, you can go ahead and stab this boy, Bacon. Uh, you're trying to escape. What do we got? It's like nobody here. Everybody's somewhere else. Go stop her. Take him down, did I? Uh oh. Okay, that one's down. You can uh, take him out. Who are you shooting at? You're shooting at Savage. Savage, why are you here? Get behind cover and shoot him. Oh, that fucking sucks, dude! Oh, I didn't even think about that. The shield they were carrying. Dude, we've been carrying that shield forever. Aw, oh, dude, that's super lame. Stab this idiot in the back. Norma, you ass. You absolute shit. Alright, please rescue our idiot children. I mean, they're not our children. I mean, they kind of are. How are you doing? You're free to go. I can't believe she blew the shield like that. Should have thought about that before I uh, shot at her, I guess. If we went strictly into melee, it might have been fine. Well, that's what we get for keeping slaves. All right, is anybody going to save this idiot? What the fuck are you jokers doing? Fuck. Okay. Um, what dumbass? You. Uh, immediately tend... See, this is a problem I have where uh, you have di people who are dying and they get reserved by somebody who's like a thousand miles away and has half of a leg left. And then they just decide that they're going to be the one to tend and nobody else is going to and they just fucking die. Okay, Cynic's already on that one. I mean, to be fair, I kind of want these assholes to die, but I mean, it's better if they don't. All right. Uh, let's get him into bed. Great, yeah, and we'll use some actual medicine that way to mitigate infection risk. Okay. Please get the guns out of the rain. I guess Toll's bow might have already been hauled by somebody. Uh, Ryan, crash and transport pod, pair like a beige. Uh, um... Welcome, Ryan. Oh my god. Hard worker, depressive, and tough. It's not bad. Except for, you know, all of this. 
and the and the you know <laughs> the paralytic abasia too. So we'll just uh, we'll just give them the old uh, spear based treatment that we uh, can easily do. Oh no, he's not getting better. Oh, I tried everything I could possibly do and I, nothing worked. We could have stripped him. Yeah, that, uh, it's not great. You can bring him back. All right, tools up. Did you get your bow back? Oh, you have your bow back. Is that the right bow? Because Yeah, that's green, green ring around it. it means it's a good quality recurve bow, which is his meme weapon. Um, how about a skull? It's been a while since we extracted the skull, maybe. Let's get that done. Do we have... Yeah, it looks to me like we have the capability to build more skulls. Let's just uh, queue up a bunch of skull blueprints, like we do. Almost tempted to, like, board over the swamp. But well, we can move to the north and south of it, so it's not really that important to do. Infection. Infection. Norma. Norma. Fuck you, Norma. You idiot. 54% 10. Bacon. 32%. Eesh. Well, that one's a 70%. He should, he should just use like the same immunity. So does it roll the better of the two tens? I don't know how that works. Well, Slave Rebellion likely on you. Yeah, I have enough of those uh, to last me quite quite an episode. I think we're good. I'll just stab you a few times and you'll be fine. See, you can't rebel if you've got holes in your body. That's how that works. This son of a bitch prison broke. Man, we're getting a lot of uh, rebellions today, and I am not a fan of it. Um, here's hoping we don't kill somebody. A lot of them have wrist blades, so it's uh, pretty likely that we kill somebody. Nope, guys. Please don't shoot the prisoners. Okay, why don't you guys go back here? Ah, you let them out, you idiots. You fucking dopes. Ah. You absolute idiots. Norma. Norma, Norma, Norma. Uh, you can you can now help because you're in here. Oh, now the elephant's here. Oh God. Oh, this is chaos. It's pure chaos. Oh my God. Toll, who are you fucking meleeing? Stop it. Go punch Shorty, I guess. Okay. Um. Are we are we done? No. This guy's still here. Okay, I need you to fucking... Give me a person, for fuck's sake. Uh, capture that guy. Turn to slave vet, I guess. Capture shorty. Okay, somebody has somewhere has done something. Capture that guy? Uh, you're free to go, you're free to go, you're free to go. Dude, I can't tell what the fuck is happening in here. There's like tons of just crap piled up on top of each other move it okay who's dying and who deserves to die um six hours you have absolute cut scar and the eye is fine torn off some toes five hours five hours left leg shot off is old okay dr behemoth the fuck are you doing cowering are you fucking for real no nope, fucking shit. Fuck! Ten. Butcherer. Resting. Blood drinker. Ten. Fuck me, guys. 
tend, I guess. At least somebody's doing it. Your infections. How are you doing? 51, 78, 78, 56. You should be fine. Are you actually a medic? Fucking nope. Well, that's fine. As long as they ain't dying. Okay, well, you can take this over then. And Norma can fuck off. Uh, Bear, are you just sitting in here drafted? You are. Savage also sitting in here drafted. Yeah, I don't know how many people I grabbed roped into this prison rebellion. Apparently it was uh, more people than I was expecting. And that is the shirt. Great. Okay. All the idiots are back in jail. Everything's probably fine. Um, Elder One has formed a bond. Oh my god. Master is now Cynic, I guess. Um... Do I even want a combat elephant at that point? I guess. Because we're not going to, like, send the elephant in as, like, a suicide. We'll, we'll just let the elephant go in when we, like, need the elephant to go in. Desperation plays, or when, like, they breach the line anyway. And then the elephant can just help with the other melee. It's not bad. Um, what was I doing? I was doing this. I expanded the storage just slightly into this tunnel. Uh, then we hit some steel back here that we could mine out if we want. Really don't need it. Holy shit. 3k steel. Yeah, no, we're not even going to mine that steel out. We just uh, got ourselves three whole extra tiles worth of storage. Can I... No, that's all shit swampland over there. Yeah, we really don't gain any ground. We could do that. Gain one tile there. Eh. Not really worth it. Slave Rebellion likely. Fastelson. Yeah, I'm really tired of these Slave Rebellions, let me tell you that much. Um, it's almost like it's a price you pay for some slave labor. Go punch Fastelson in the head a bunch. Where'd he go? Wait, where, where did he go? Oh, he's over here now. Bigot's chasing him. He's coming for him. You're cleaning dirt? On that door? This is really funny. Bacon is so fucking slow. All right, Bacon, just just go. Alistair, you're right here. Go punch Fastelson. He's heading your way. It's perfect. Oh, how did he evade you? You worthless shit. Get in there and punch him. Slaves suppressing slaves. Uh, and there he goes. He's just heading off in another direction. Toll, can you stand up? Yeah, go punch this man. He's coming in here anyway. All right, there. Suppressed. Okay. Are we good dudes? Dudettes? Maybe. Cloth flop hat. Yeah, you know what? Uh, we're just going to go ahead and uh, toss all flop hats in here. Uh, it seems like a good thing to me. Let's just get that shit in the swamp. Oh my god, the fucking infections! I mean, to be fair, I'm stabbing them with feral weaponry that's probably covered in tetanus, but like, whatever. These guys are predators. It'll be fine. Um, okay. That is base game, right? Yeah, that's insectoids. Or vanilla expanded insectoids. Effectively base game. Okay, we'll deal with that in the morning then. Let's deal with these insects. Uh, I've got Dr. Behemoth removing Alistair's stomach in the meantime because he actually is dead tied, but 10 quality 7% I think means he's fucked. I, do, I don't think he's going to make it. Like, yeah, I think he's fucked. He's got to be, right? I'm making the right call. All right. Uh, if you will get over here, that'd be great. Blood drinker. Give me some various short-range gunners on the front lines. Um, we've got chef as well. Slug. And bear. And the rest of you can just filter in here. Take up rear guard positions. Fastelson has a long range weapon. You can just take a, a spot in the middle. Do not be on running gun. You're not. Should be fine. Actually, are they gonna come in? 
We might need to destroy their ship completely for them to actually properly aggro. I'm not sure. Cynic, get up there too. Uh, did we do it? Yep, stomach removed. Uh, give me Dr. Behemoth. Oh, um... I guess. Better for the prisoner if he gets over it quick, I suppose. If they hit the traps, yeah. Once well, they hit the traps, they should come in for sure. Uh, sorry, elephant, what are you fucking carrying? Herbal medicine times two. You know what? We'll allow it. Okay, are the rest of them doing anything? Wait, where are the rest of them? Okay, um, it looks like it's actually all of them. I'm not sure quite how that worked out. I th it looked, I thought we had a solid half of them left behind after the other ones. Uh, give me that valuable, valuable chitin though, guys. That'd be great. Oh, there are some down here. I guess they might have... They might have ran north afterwards and hit traps. Yeah, there's one there. Uh, maybe that's what happened. Second wave of them came in after the other ones hit the traps, and they just kind of ate shit and died, I guess. There's still, like, little larvae. You know what? Maybe I just saw the larvae. Maybe that's what it was. Uh, why does this rhino hurt? Is somebody a spiky trap? Oh, the rhino triggered a trap. Looks like you. That's a whole ass neomorph. Okay. Um. Seems to be the only neomorph on the map. So the question now becomes why? Why is neomorph? Why neomorph be like this? Uh. So it might be that there was an infested animal or a neomorph spawn that we missed previously, or we might have fungus on the map somewhere else. I don't see any evidence of fungus down here. But if we had fungus somewhere else, I don't even know where the hell I would find it. Okay. Um... This group, you guys can go, I'll go on running gun, head over towards here, and we're going to deal with uh, that, those bugs while we head out to get that Neomorph. Um, Are you guys shooting other bugs? Yeah, there's other bugs here. All right, why don't you guys leave? You're you're in bad shape. We shouldn't need this many people for like one neomorph, I don't think. But maybe. But we do have like the swamp here between us and it, which might work. Uh oh yeah, I just fucking died. Dead for less than a day. Age four. Born the 11th of Jugist. Four days old. Hmm. I am super concerned that there's more spores here. Okay, well, here's what we can assume. If there's no more spores, we dealt with it, right? The problem is over. Because any animals should have hatched by now that we're going to hatch. Basically. Bacon overdose. I'm not even going to look at that. Oh, I think they just tag that bug as they walk past. That's fine. Toll's going to shoot somebody in the spine. And that's not okay. 
Okay, there's all that dealt with. Let's get all this crap hauled out of here, including the steel, which I'm just kind of cleaning off the map for, like, lack of anything else to do. We could, uh, look inside this hillside for some stuff, because we know there's a wall here. We never did find, like, an ancient danger on this map. We could start digging for that. It's not likely to be there. That's just, uh, probably a standard building. There's probably nothing to it, nothing interesting to be found. Uh, looks to me like we could use some plant harvesting, make more pemmican, so let's make sure we get that done. Just do some extended harvests out here. Wherever we can without hitting our own fields, of course. Psychite addiction. Boy, do I not care. All right. Well, I think we're done here then with the ship and the Neomorph incident. Sad Wonder Chef. I wonder if the Neomorph gets us some... Um... Uh, Xeno leather, or if it's got like its own thing. Let's find that out real quick, out of curiosity. I think he's got to butcher all these insects though before he can butcher the Neomorph. Which is maybe, maybe this isn't uh, the best idea, especially because they keep all the more bugs in. Uh, you know what? It's fine. We'll let, he's almost done. We can we just let him finish. We we'll let him do his thing. He's living up to his name. You know, it's what he's here for. It's fine. I like the Neomorph design. I'm kind of, it's kind of too bad it doesn't get more action. Like, I I think Co Alien Covenant would have been much better if it was just Neomorphs. And just shoehorning the Xeno into the second half just makes it like this weird two-part movie where it's got like two unconnected villains in different segments that don't relate to each other at all. It's just strange. Um, butcher, you're, okay, you're already free to go because you butchered everything. Yes, that tracks. All right, well, on that little bit of commentary, we can uh, end this episode.